Did you know that Hada Studio, the creators behind Tower of Fantasy, are back with a new urban open-world RPG called Neverness to Everness, set in a futuristic city full of supernatural occurrences? No way. That's so exciting. I remember Tower of Fantasy was such a hit with its light sci-fi and anime aesthetics. What makes this new game stand out? Well, for starters, Neverness to Everness is utilizing Unreal Engine 5, which is a huge upgrade. They're also incorporating advanced tech like NVIDIA DLSS rendering and ray tracing. The visuals are expected to be mind-blowing. Wow, that's impressive. It sounds like they're really pushing the envelope with this one. So what's the story behind Neverness to Everness? The game is set in a massive metropolis called Hethero, where humans coexist with anomalies, supernatural occurrences with varying effects. Some are minor inconveniences, while others can be major crises. Players use something called Esper ability to handle these anomalies. That sounds fascinating. So players have these special powers to deal with anomalies. Do they go at it alone, or are there other characters involved? Players will meet new characters who join their team to tackle these anomalies. It's a mix of solo and team-based gameplay. And what's interesting is that these characters have their own unique abilities and stories. I love games that incorporate rich character development. It adds so much depth to the story. Speaking of depth, how does the game world look and feel? The city has been designed with incredible detail, thanks to Unreal Engine 5. The innermost sections of the city have a dark cyberpunk vibe, while other areas are bursting with vibrant colors. It's a blend that keeps the world feeling fresh and dynamic. That's so interesting. It's like they managed to create a city that feels alive and constantly evolving. Are there any side activities for players aside from dealing with anomalies? Absolutely. Players can modify sports cars for races, gather accessories to improve their home, and explore a variety of buildings. It's all about creating a unique lifestyle within the game. Modifying sports cars? That sounds like a blast. And designing your own home, it's like they've combined the best elements of RPGs and life simulation games. Exactly. The urban framework allows for a cohesive and realistic city experience, complete with intricate decor and immersive street vibes. By day, Hethero is inviting, and by night, it's filled with eerie lighting and mysterious puddles. Very atmospheric. It makes me think about how important atmosphere is in games like these. The details really pull you in. What about combat? How does that play out? The combat system is pretty straightforward but engaging, with different enemy designs and combat styles based on weapons and abilities. It's bound to keep players on their toes. Sounds like a perfect mix of exploration, combat, and storytelling. For fans of anime-style RPGs like Genshin Impact, this seems like a must-play. Absolutely. And although there's no official release date yet, people can sign up for beta testing on the game's official website. It'll be available on PC, console, and mobile, joining the ranks of other multi-platform free-to-play games. I can't wait to dive into this world and see what it's all about. Thanks for sharing all this amazing info, Tom. Anytime, Lily. And to our listeners, thanks for joining us today. If you want more updates on Neverness to Everness and other exciting game news, be sure to follow or subscribe. See you next time. Bye everyone and happy gaming!